With the help of the Canadian Centre for DNA Barcoding, or CCDB, the International Barcode of Life Project is creating a barcode reference database of short standardized gene regions. Their goal is the identification and discovery of 5 million specimens from more than 500,000 species over the next five years. Here we will show the CCDB's protocol for DNA amplification using PCR. Following DNA extraction, the next step is DNA amplification using PCR. To set up the PCR plate, two microliters of extracted DNA sample is added to a pre-made PCR plate containing master mix. The plate is then sealed and spun in the centrifuge. After centrifugation, the PCR plate is sealed again using a heat sealer to prevent evaporation during PCR. The plate is spun again for one minute at 1000 G, then placed in a thermocycler for DNA amplification. This concludes the PCR step. We work with really small volumes. Our reaction volume slightly exceeds 10 microliters. For PCR, the total volume is 12.5 microliters, Told that is added DNA. Liquidator allows to handle small volumes easily, both for PCR and for cycle sequencing setup.